Hi guys, it's Brooke and Pippa. And today I'm going to be doing something a little weird, I guess, is showing you my outdoor shower setup. It is one of the upgrades I made over the last six months is to have an outdoor shower. And it's not one of those solar showers or anything like that. So I'm gonna take you along on kind of what I do. And I'm gonna do it on a busy road. Um, hold on. So as you can see, I've got lots of volume, lots of dry shampoo going on up here. And so since I'm not going to get naked in front of all of these people driving by, I'm just going to wash my hair and show you guys how I do that and using the solar shower. So let's go. You want to come hang out with me outside, Pip? Yeah, let's go show them. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you my outdoor shower. The, so this is the outdoor shower I picked. Sorry, it's a little loud. I'm boiling some water so I can take a warm shower. And this is really cool. I got this. I got this Reliance um, outdoor shower. It's a two gallon tank uh, at REI. It was around $40, I believe. And so you just take this pump right here to pressurize it. So you just keep pumping, pumping, pumping. I'm not gonna do all of it because I still have some water to add. Um, and then you take this little sprayer right here and the water is pressurized, you know, when it's fully pressurized and it comes out just like that. So the nice thing about it is you don't have to like hang it from a tree. I don't have to hang it from my car, anything like that. And like I said in this video, I'm just gonna wash my hair, uh, but it holds about two gallons and I leave about a gallon of water in there uh, all the time because I use it to rinse off my feet at night if I'm in kind of like a muddy, if I'm in kind of like a muddy situation or I use it to rinse off dishes if I had like a messier kind of cooking situation I needed to like really soap up and clean dishes or I use it to also wash Pippa out here as well. So I just use Dr. Bronner's soap um, when I shower outside um, more eco-friendly, biodegradable, all the good stuff, and it's easy to find. So I can use it to wash the dog. I can use it to wash dishes. I can use it for like general cleaning. I can use it for everything. So I always keep a bottle of that on hand. So I'm going to show you now what I'm going to do next. All right, and now I have clean hair. Um, so basically I just filmed this whole last clip and I did it in slow-mo on my phone instead of regular. So uh, that's awkward. So anyways, hmm. if I were to continue showering, if it wasn't so busy here, I would just rinse my body, soap up with Dr. Bronner's on like a washcloth or something, soap everywhere, rinse off, get back dressed. It's like a five second deal. Uh, this isn't like a luxury thing. It's just, you know, a get clean. And even if I am somewhere more private, I still usually shower in between my car doors 
just in case somebody rolls up, you know? Um, but that's why I like to shower at Planet Fitness because I can just go in there and I can stand under the hot water. It's a little more of like a luxury thing, but I'm just going to wait for my hair to air dry. I don't have a way to plug in a hair dryer in the car, uh, but my hair dries naturally curly and it dries pretty quick, especially because I'm in a drier climate. Um, so I'm just going to wait for it to air dry and then flat iron it with um the flat iron that works with my jackery i've in my um get ready in the car with me video i go over um that straightener how it works all of that kind of stuff but this was just to kind of show you my shower setup when i'm camped out somewhere for an extra couple days or i'm far from a planet fitness or just want to keep camping and i don't want to drive into town just yet this is how i just really quick get clean and feel refreshed and for you know forty dollars it was a nice nice upgrade to the car i really um love having it i love that i can rinse my feet off when rinse pippa off if she rolls in something you know wash my dishes with soap and water when they need you know a really good wash instead of just kind of a wipe down all of the above so uh i hope this helps some of you guys out it's really easy to store like i said it's only two gallons and that's that so i hope that you enjoyed seeing my new upgraded shower outside routine <laughs> and Pippa and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye!